This rally in Alawa was a protest about refugees and housing. It was also the launch of a new far-right organization. Its black and yellow banners belong to a group called Scottish Dawn. So you need to wake up, you need to fight for your children's future before it's too late. No surrender. ITV News understands it's now suspected of being a front for another banned neo-Nazi organization. In March, we asked if there was any link. Can you tell me why you're a fighter's oh, oh, Because you like to cover it. Are you, is anyone in national action in this group? National no, action? What are you talking about? Never heard of them. Never heard of them. National action is the white supremacist group outlawed last year after celebrating the death of MP Joe Cox. Membership is an offence. We stand for the sign of fatality and death. When some of the same protesters attended a rally in Perth last weekend, the yellow flags had disappeared. Amid fears on the far right that its symbol might attract the attention of the authorities, some protesters denied any association with NA. Say again. They don't exist. But then, unprompted, one claimed to be a member of the group. Claiming to be a member of a prescribed group is an offence. New Scottish Dawn members are recruited using the same encrypted messaging system used by National Action. They're screened online. A response to our inquiry asked for a location, a brief description of why the person wanted to be involved, where and how they heard of the group. Then they were invited for an interview. Members use aliases, but the real name of this one is Ruri McKim, a stonemason from Edinburgh. We've tried to speak to him. It's Rohit from uh, ITV here. But just like Scottish Dawn's flags, some of its members have disappeared. The former reviewer of terrorism legislation says members of groups are used to circumventing the rules. There are ways around prescription. However, I don't think members of any proscribed organisation should underestimate the, very, the many different ways of detecting them. And so officials are now considering whether one group has simply morphed into another. Rohit Katru, News at 10.